Just coming off the game uh, Saturday night, um, really proud of my team, um, the passion and the fight that they played with. It was very evident um, live. It was very evident as I watched the tape. Um, that's something that I think we've made a big improvement on this year. I shared it with our guys early this morning in the team meeting that their care factor continues to go up because their investment level goes up. And um, we continue to invest and get off the mat and come compete at a high, high level um, every week. Results on the scoreboard aren't there, not where we want. It's not, it's not um, the final result that we want. But I will tell you the things behind the scenes are really changing. And the, it's very process driven. And I think there's, we've got more and more buy-in. You have to have a lot of buy-in to win games at this level. Um, I do know this that the hurt from the last two games, the K-State and the TCU game, the hurt the day, the night, you know, in the locker room the day after is a lot higher than it was earlier in the year. Like, for instance, the Arizona game. And the reason is, it's not because they didn't care then, it's just because the level of investment is way higher now. So the more you invest, the higher you care. The higher you care, uh, the longer you're going to hold the rope. Um, those are things that are maybe not important for the media to hear, but it's important for me. And so I'm just kind of giving you a state of the union right now. Um, so the things behind the scenes in this team meeting room um, that are starting to turn around um, are very, very positive, and it's things that continue to inspire me to help get this program where we all want it to be and where Red Raider Nation wants it to be, and that's in the month of November competing for championships, and I truly believe that we're, we're going to be there very, very soon. Um, I'm very um, thankful. Um, as well as grateful for our senior class. Um, I wish we could have sent those guys out as winners in terms of on the scoreboard in Jones Stadium for the last time. Um, you know, our bowl game will be this week in Austin, and that's how we'll treat it um, for those guys. And our guys will be absolutely ready to go into Austin and compete um, with Texas, uh, which has a good team and a good program, excellent coaching staff and um, a great leader at quarterback and a lot of long athletic guys on defense uh, to have to contend with. 